All right, let's talk about the FAA's brand new proposed rule, Part 108, and why it's a big deal for drones. Right now, if you want to fly beyond visual line of sight or BV loss, you're stuck going through the process of getting a waiver. Every mission has to be individually approved, which is slow, inconsistent, and not exactly scalable. Part 108 changes that. Instead of ask every time, the FAA is moving to a system where BV loss ops are allowed by rule. That means faster approvals and more predictable operations and a clear path forward for the drone industry. Here are the highlights. First, companies not individual pilots take the lead. Under Part 108, your organization is responsible for training, compliance, and safety. No separate BV loss pilot license, just make sure your people meet the training standards. Second, two paths to operate. Permits for lower risk missions like agriculture, surveying, deliveries in low density areas, and certificates for higher risk or more complex flights like over dense population or with heavier aircraft. Third, weight and population categories. Drones are grouped into weight classes, up to 55 pounds, 110 pounds, and 1,320 pounds. And where you can fly depends on the population density category from rural to urban. Fourth, new players, automated data service providers. These folks handle real-time airspace and traffic data so your drone stays out of trouble. You can even be your own ADSP if you meet the requirements. Fifth, safety and security. Operation supervisors and flight coordinators must pass TSA background checks and you'll need solid cybersecurity in place. In some airspace, you'll also need onboard detect and avoid tech. And here's something brand new, rest limits for operators. Max 14 hours in a day, 50 hours in a week, with 10 hours off between shifts. That's the first time we've seen that in drone rules. The FAA is taking public comments right now, and the deadline is October 6, 2025. So if you care about the future of BV loss, this is your chance to speak up. In short, Part 108 could take BV loss from rare, waiver-only flights to routine, scalable operations. It's not final yet, but if it passes, the sky, quite literally, opens up. For more information, visit www.sdi.edu today.